Governor Kate Brown here to stand in solidarity with Oregonians celebrating Juneteenth, also known as Emancipation Day, which marks the end of slavery. Oregon has been celebrating this day since 1945, when Clara Peoples brought the tradition of the celebration with her from Oklahoma. Even though we lost Ms. Peoples in 2015, her legacy is carried on by her granddaughter, Janelle Jack, who's been working really hard to organize an annual citywide event in Portland. I want to thank all the organizers of Juneteenth 2020 and everyone working for racial justice, especially black Oregonians, for your dedication and determination to make Oregon a just and equitable state. To center and amplify black voices in communities around the state, I've asked some of Oregon's lawmakers to share their personal reflections on the meaning of Juneteenth. Thank you so much for sharing. Juneteenth means a great deal to me. It is a personal situation, not an academic or historic one. My uh, great grandfather is in this picture, was a freed slave and was freed on Juneteenth. So the family celebrates Juneteenth every year and has for more than a hundred years. In January, 1863, President Abraham Lincoln signed into law the Emancipation Proclamation freeing the American slaves, but not until 19 June 1865 did the slaves in Texas and other southern states find out they had been freed two years earlier. Sometimes it's easy to forget um, how this nation came to be, how we gained our wealth, how we gained our status, how we became a world power. And it was on the necks of and on the backs of Black people, of African American people. And so the celebration of Juneteenth is a celebration of our contribution to this country. It's a celebration of understanding that, yes, we had this original sin, and yes, it is still our job to wipe that clean and truly liberate Black people in the state of Oregon and in the United States of America. And what Juneteenth means to me is a recognition of the promises of our Constitution finally being realized. Of course, today we are still on a journey to being free, but I'm all too happy to be a part of that journey and to make it come true for my children and my children's children. This year, celebrating Black freedom and achievement on Juneteenth is more important than ever. As people across Oregon and around the world protest racism and unequivocally show that black lives matter. I'm issuing an official proclamation that June 19th, 2020 is Juneteenth in Oregon and will introduce a bill in the 2021 legislative session to make Juneteenth a state holiday for years to come. I know this is only a small yet important step to address Oregon's history of racial discrimination. I remain committed to addressing racial disparities through the intentional integration of racial equity in every single decision. Be safe out there.